Hello and welcome to Daily Tech Video. In this video, we will see how to install SSD on MacBook Pro. Uh, this is actually a presentation which I have compiled with the pictures I have taken while installing the MacBook, uh, while installing SSD on my MacBook Pro 15 inch, uh, which is mid 2010 model. Um, so, installing SSD on uh, MacBook Pro and removing the HDD uh, which comes with the MacBook Pro 15 inch or 13 inch is pretty easier and you don't have to take it to any service center or uh, to any other third party centers to uh, complete this process. You can do it all by yourself and make sure you have a correct screwdriver uh, to open the uh, back panel of the MacBook Pro. Uh, that is one important step we have to uh, be very careful with. Uh, rest, it is completely easy and you, don't, you will not screw up anything. Uh, you know, um, it, once you follow this e easy steps. So you have to unscrew all the uh, almost 8 to 10 screws I believe uh, in the back side of your MacBook Pro you can see. Uh, so unscrew all of them with suitable screwdriver. Uh, find the correct uh, size of the uh, holder and unscrew all of them. Uh, then at the left bottom uh, of the MacBook Pro you can find the hard disk uh, drive uh, which comes with your MacBook Pro. You will find a plastic leaf uh, type of thing at the mid position of your hard disk drive. Unscrew these two areas and uh, you can easily lift out the hard disk drive from your MacBook Pro. Here there will be two screws, one is here and the other one is at the right side of your uh, hard disk drive position. So once you have uh, done that, uh, you can lift up the hard disk drive and you have to unplug the uh, SATA cable from your uh, hard disk drive to remove it completely uh, from the MacBook. This plastic leaf is just a sticker type of thing so you can uh, remove this and fix it on your uh, new SSD uh, to make the replacement once again easy if you want to replace or uh, upgrade it again uh, in future. So this is the hard disk drive I have removed uh, from uh, the MacBook Pro 15 inch and connecting the SSD is very simple just uh, plug the SATA cable to your SSD drive. I have bought 120 GB from Flipkart if you are from India you can search for best deals for uh, SSDs uh, in Flipkart website uh, also eBay. So once you have connected remove that leaf uh, sticker type of thing and fix it here with your SSD drive and fix it properly there will not be any oversized problem it will fix perfectly it will fit perfectly into your MacBook Pro hard disk drive space so once you have done with that just make sure you have screwed these two areas okay this is not a completely unscrewable uh, uh, you know completely you cannot unscrew these two areas but you can just uh, lose the uh, area and you can remove the hard disk drive so it is must to lose the particular uh, uh, type of that plastic uh, area and before removing your hard disk drive so complete that screw uh, process and that is it you have successfully installed your new SSD on your MacBook Pro. So once you have completed this screw uh, things and everything, just uh, boot your computer with window. I'm sorry, with 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 MacBook. Uh, you know the CD which Mac OS CD which comes with your MacBook Pro. Or if you have the latest version of Mac OS X, then uh, put that in the Super Drive and let the first boot start from your uh, Super Drive, which will begin the Mac uh, set Mac OS X setup process. 
So in this option, it is important to select the disk utility before proceeding with the installation of Mac OS X. Because we have to format the uh, Mac, uh, SSD uh, which will uh, compatible for Mac OS X. So here choose Mac OS X standard, journaled and proceed to the next step and make sure you have selected the right drive in the left side of this disk utility screen. All right, in this screen uh, you will see the installation of Mac OS X. Once you have completed the format, you will be taken back to um, this screen and you have to click on reinstall Mac OS X and click on continue. You will see this screen, click on continue and your installation process will begin and it will take less than 20 minutes as it is an SSD drive, it will be, uh, for me it took actually uh, 10 to 15 minutes maximum uh, to complete the installation of Mac OS X, Lion. So once you have successfully installed the Mac operating system, configure the settings as it will take you to uh, in a step-by-step -step way. Configure your mouse or trackpad or keyboard, whatever you have connected through Bluetooth. That's it. You have completed the uh, hard disk uh, drive replacement with SSD installation and uh, finally the Mac OS X as well. So run the update once again uh, to keep your Mac OS X software uh, section up to date. Uh, that's all. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. And please do uh, comment if you have uh, any doubts regarding this installation process. Uh, and we'll be glad to help you. And do so, don't forget to subscribe uh, to our, our daily YouTube channel. Thank you. Have a great day.